Okay. Hey guys. What, you wanna do it? Yeah, one of those. One of those? Okay. Hey guys, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Makai's World, World and Coastal Cousins Adventures. Hey, have you guys ever been to historic Charleston, South Carolina? Well, we have, and we're gonna show you all about what it's like. So stay tuned to the end, we'll tell you all about this place. And while you're watching this, make sure you comment, subscribe, click the like, hit the notification. And all right, you ready? Yep, let's go. Yep. So historic Charleston is, I mean, that was pretty cool, right? Wait, where's, where's Mackay? Oh, there he is, okay. So, historic Charleston, we had a really good time there. It's us, Costa Cousins, hanging out. <laughs> so obviously we're not down in Charleston, South Carolina right now, we're back in Costa Rica. We we're visiting friends and family and having a really good time. But now that we're back in Costa Rica, we're gonna tell you all about this trip. Yep. We got a chance to walk around the battery area of Charleston, South Carolina, down the historic district of Charleston, South Carolina. Um, that's called the Battery, some call it Battery Park, um, but I don't really know that much about it. So let's go ahead and look up some information about this area and tell you all about it, okay? And why do I always say, it? okay? So we're gonna go ahead and look up some information about yep. Charleston, South Carolina, historic district, the battery, and let's, why? let's see. Hmm? Why? Why is it called the battery? Yeah, why? Because it is what? always going and going and going. The Energizer Bunny? <laughs> no, it doesn't make any sense. It's not real. I don't know. Let's look up some stuff. Let's see what it says. Mm -hmm. Traveler of Charleston wins the award of best SEO because that's the one that came up on top. What do you want to learn about the battery? Nothing. Nothing? Okay. The battery is a landmark, defense, seawall, and promenade? 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 Promenade. Is it promenade or promenade? I bet promenade is what they serve it. Prom. Promenade? Yeah, like lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, promenade in Charleston, South Carolina, famous for its stately antebellum homes. What the? 
I guess it's called Antebellum style homes. I guess they make a whole bunch of promenade in there. It was named for a Civil War coastal, defi coastal defense artillery battery. That's why it's called the battery. Chi Chi! Trying to film a video! So it's named after an artillery battery, okay? What is that? Okay, okay. What is that? Battery? I don't know. Artillery battery is where they would make the report on the rivers and on the water and they would fight off people. Hey! This artillery battery stretches along the lower shores of the Charleston Peninsula bordered by the Ashley and Cooper Rivers. Hmm, so those, where that, where we were, is where the Ashley and Cooper Rivers intersect? I don't know. Intersect? You'll learn when you get older. <laughs> just kidding. Uh, it means when they just cross each other. Where they meet to form the Charleston Harbor. So we were at the Charleston Harbor. Learn that, okay. Okay. Historically, it's been understood to extend from the beginning of the seawall at the former Omar Shrine Temple to the intersection of what is now Murray Boulevard. I bet that's where Bill Murray lives. Murray Boulevard. <laughs> Do you, you don't know who Bill Murray is? No. Okay. It's uh, Justin Bieber's uncle. No, it's not. But either way. All right, what else can we learn about Bill Murray Boulevard and King Street? Um, um. Oh, listen to this. Fort Sumter is visible from the Cooper River side. Okay, so they used a the battery in World War II, Civil War, Fort Broughton, and Fort Wilkins during the American Revolutionary War of 1812 occupied white or oyster points. We had oysters. And it's named so because of the piles of bleached oyster shells on the point at the tip of the peninsula in the 18th century. At the I know, oysters are so good, right? Mm, boom. Rocks and heavy materials were used to fortify the shore of the Cooper River on the eastern side of the peninsula. Chi-Chi's trying to talk. Chi-Chi, you're not in the video. So the battery became a public park, blah, blah, blah. The area, now known as White Point Garden, became a place for artillery during the American Civil War. Artillery. Artillery. What does that mean? You know what artillery is. You play enough Fortnite to know. What does that mean? Artillery, like <laughs> ammo. Oh. Okay. The Battery and White Point Gardens are also referred to as Battery Park, but that's an unofficial name. That's not officially the name. That's, that's not. That's not officially the name of the official area. So Makai has just been fired from Makai's world. That's what just happened. Nope. They did a report on the battery seawall and they shown that it was not quite hurricane ready. It's, it could suffer serious problems on a serious hurricane hit. So in 2012, the city announced a $3.2 million restoration project and they said it would soon commence. Oh, the monkeys are angry here in Costa Rica. You heard that? You hear the monkeys? All right, they do that this time of evening. This is what we just found out about the battery. Uh, there's a nice video on their website here. Let me try to remember to put a link to that uh, since we got our information from them. Hopefully they got their information from a reliable source because we're repeating information to you that hopefully is re reliable. They, they look reliable. If you guys have any more information about this area, let us know down in the comments. But yeah, so the battery or battery park or White Point Garden, as they call it, Oy was the area with oysters, oysters. Oysters? With oysters, 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 oysters. roasting oysters. Wake up, you have oysters. Go to bed, you have oysters. How's it go? This is like an adult child. You wake up and you have coffee. And you take a shower and it's time for coffee. And you go to work and it's time for coffee. And you get fired and it's time for coffee. And by five o'clock, it should be time for coffee. <laughs> <laughs> What's that from? TikTok. This is historic Charleston, South Carolina. We enjoyed it. Hopefully you enjoyed this train wreck of a filming, whatever you want to call this. This is Makai's world. This is our world. This is our life as a family. So take it or leave it. Thank you guys for hanging out on another episode of Makai's World and Coastal Cousins Adventures. Make sure you comment, subscribe, 
share, hit the links in the description, check out what we're using, what we're filming on, all of our equipment, all those things, all right? So thank you guys very much for hanging out. Pura vida, vida. and peace. peace. Probably won't be able to use any of that garbage.